guys, welcome to another episode of Grizzly Beer Reviews. My name's Tommy, and today I'm drinking Lagunitas The Hairy Eyeball. Um, I have had this once before, but I don't remember what it was like. It was a while ago. Um, I'm pretty sure it's like a kind of like an old ale or a barley wine. Um, it doesn't say on it exactly what it is, so it's kind of it's probably just a uh, just a weird beer they made that they didn't have a label for. But I'm gonna get right into it. Ooh, that's a nice, deep, ruby red. Very clear, though, still see-through. Um, poured about two fingers ahead. It's a really nice, tight, uh, tan, beige head. Yeah, it smells like an old ale. Um, has, like, the complex, dark fruits to it. Like, black cherries, prunes. Maybe like dried apricots. Hmm. You can definitely smell that sweet malt in the background. It smells super, super good. So I'm gonna get right into it. Oh wow. Man, that is a lot better than I remembered. It's really thick, but not in a bad way. It's not overpowering. Mm. Yeah, it's not quite a barley wine. I'd say it's more of an old ale. Because there's a lot of malt. There's not any of that uh, bitter hoppiness that you get in barley wines. Um, there's honey. You can taste honey. Maybe like raisins. Or maybe like golden raisins is more like it. Not necessarily the regular raisins, but golden raisins. Um, craisins. A lot of that dark fruit. But also just that really nice, roasty, caramel, sweet malt. That honey, you can definitely taste a lot of honey. Um, man, this is just super, super delicious. Like I said before, Lagunitas is definitely in my top five breweries. They're so good. They make amazing beer, and they sell it at a really good price. Um, I just love them. And uh, this beer is incredible. It's, it's probably one of my favorites that they've done. Um, but anyways, Lagunitas, the hairy eyeball. If you haven't had it, try it. Um, thank you for joining me for another episode. Check back for new reviews, new updates. Um, this has been a great beer.